this morning, crews are expected to begin taking down the controversial Confederate monument at Munn Park in Lakeland. Let's go now to News Channel 8's Corey Davis. He's live out there now, and Corey, police are being guarding this, making sure that everything goes smoothly today. Hey, Marco and Melissa, good morning to you. Yeah, and you know, police have already seen a few hecklers this week. Nothing too serious as that process got underway to begin to take down this monument here in Munn Park. I can tell you fencing is already in place as well as that work gets underway. I want to give you a look at some video at the progress that has been made so far. Crews have been putting in braces around the monument for the past few days. And we're told the Confederate soldier at the top will be the first piece to be removed. This whole process has been met with heated debate from both sides. There's a group called Save Southern Heritage. They hoped a federal judge could block, would block uh, the city of Lakeland from moving the Confederate monument, but the judge dismissed that lawsuit. The statue has been here in Munn Park for more than 100 years, but we're told it'll be fully dismantled by Monday, then moved to Veterans Park behind the RP Funding Center just a short walk away. The statue will be placed there among others that are honoring those who died in previous wars. And police are expecting some onlookers here in Munn Park when that crane is brought in at 7 o'clock. And you can count on us to keep you updated on air and on our WFLA mobile app. For now, we're live here in downtown Lakeland. Corey Davis, News Channel 8.